guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Pam Obasa from The Lucrative Lady. And today I am going to be talking about one of the newest features on Instagram called Instagram Reels, yes. But if it is your first time seeing this face, then welcome, I'm Pamela Bassa and I help course creators, coaches, service-based entrepreneurs to absolutely smash social media, getting leads and clients on autopilot. And in this video, I'm going to be walking you through exactly how to use this new feature. Now, Instagram Reels has only been out a couple of weeks and already it is absolutely smashing a lot of the other platforms that are out there. And that is because if you know anything about social media news and what's happening right now concerning TikTok specifically, TikTok looks like it might be talking its way out of our phones because a lot of countries might be banning TikTok. And so of course, a lot of people who had uh, accrued a massive amount of audience on TikTok are now looking for a way to use, uh, to move their audience to and you know which other platforms to use. And so here come Instagram who then created a feature which is pretty much nearly identical to TikTok uh, in so many ways. So for example, on TikTok, you know, the maximum length of videos was 15 seconds. Instagram Reels, it's also 15 seconds. So Instagram are pretty much uh, have created this as competition for TikTok, giving TikTok creators a place to move all of their content to. But if you didn't have any audience on TikTok, listen, you haven't missed out on anything because you can be one of the few, the first few who actually take advantage of Instagram Reels. And one of the reasons why it's really, really important to start now, to start early, is because one thing I know about social media that absolutely works is that if you are one of the first few, if you are one of the first ones, the founding members almost, who start out when it first starts, that platform rewards you with higher reach. And that's certainly what I have noticed with my brand using Instagram Reels. So let me walk you through exactly how to set up your very first Instagram Reel. Hold up a minute, before I show you exactly how to create your own Instagram Reels, I wanna show you just an example of what is possible with Instagram Reels. So in preparation for recording this video, I obviously published my own Reels just so that I can show you this and take a look at this. This is amazing results. A combination of 1,974 views on these 15 second videos that I created less than 24 hours ago. So this is incredible. Almost 2,000 views have, um, have come onto my account and so much that I could do with that. I could run ads to those views. And not only that, but I've actually gained followers, I've gained new fans and I've gained brand awareness. So if you are skeptical and unsure about, you know, whether you can use Instagram Reels for your business, then I hope that these results will motivate you. And if you stick around until the end of this video, I will actually show you what my exact Instagram Reels that gained me these amazing views were about. So stick around until the end. Let's hit the tutorial. Okay, so I wanna show you, give you a quick walkthrough for how to create your very first Instagram Reel. So this is obviously my own IG account. If you're not following me, make sure you go over there to Pamabasa to follow me over there. But how do you even find your own Instagram Reel? So if you go on the Explore tab over here, you will see various Instagram Reels. It's, it's really, really awesome. And once you click on that Reel icon, you get to see lots of creators who you don't even follow. Right, so it's really, really interesting. And just like with everything else, you can totally um, interact with these uh, with these creators. So you can, if you want to make a comment, for example, you can click on that speech bubble and you can go ahead and you can comment. If you want to send it to somebody, you can click on that uh, kite and you can send it uh, send it uh, to whoever you want to send it to. So that's uh, the real, the, the feed for the reels over there. Oh, look at that, cute. Anyway. So let's go back to figuring out how you can create your own Instagram Reel. So what I do is I go back to home and I go as though I'm going to be creating a story. And so over here it says add to story. So now I clicked add to story, right? And now what you can see is that it gives me three different options. So if you have Reels already as part of, um, you know, in your country, then you will see it at the bottom. You'll notice that right there at the bottom, it gives you three options. One says live, the other says story, the other says Reels. Now, before we go into Reels, let me just show you so 
one of the new things that has happened because Reels has uh, Reels is now here for a lot of people is that a lot of the things in stories has now been condensed. So if I click on that button, you can see that it has create, then it has uh, boomerang, it has layout, it has dual, it has super zoom, hands free, and then up there to condense everything to close it. So you have a, quite a few more options that have gone into the stories section. Now, in Reels, which is to the right over here, you don't have quite as many options, but let's click over and see exactly what you have. So in Reels, you have four different options. Now, what I do like about this is that um, in order to create your Reels, you literally just follow, uh, follow in order. So the first thing you see over here is uh, music. That's the first thing you do for Reels. If you want to add music, all you do is click on the music icon and you can scroll through to select what music you want. And if the music, uh, that if you can't find the music you want over here in For You, you can click over here and browse. And right there, you can just uh, search for the type of music that you want and find that music, right? So let's imagine that you have now selected your music. So I'm gonna click on cancel to go back. The next thing right, at the, uh, right underneath music is this uh, icon here which is for your speed. So you get to select how fast you want it to go. So you can go super fast, you can go super slow, you can do slow motion, uh, all of those important things you can do right here. Now I'm going to keep it the same and I'm going to instead go over here to uh, to effects. Now, one of the great things about effects is that when it comes to reels, you have a lot of um, effects options. If you keep scrolling, you can choose which effect you want. So for example, if I, if I come in uh, over here, you can choose which effect um, you want over there, right? So you can see me over there. You can see lots of uh, changes can happen. Um, you can totally do all sorts of fun, uh, super cool things with effects. Let me wait for this to change so we can see what effect this is. Here we are. Okay, brilliant. And if I scroll all the way um, to the end, you can then browse loads of different effects. So I'm going to... Oh, it's going to show me what, what effects you can browse. Here we are. Right, you can browse loads of different types of effects over there. So I'm going to cancel and just go back. So effects. Now, the other thing you can do is timer. This is where you can set the timer for your reel, right? Now, the maximum duration for your Instagram reels is 15 seconds, but you can put together several different videos for this. So for example, this is set to five seconds or I could set it all the way to 15 seconds. So if I wanted to put together, say three different clips for my Instagram Reels, I might set them each um, to five seconds, right? For each one. And then I can record one after the other and piece them all together. So once I have set my timer, I can click on set timer, the blue one, but I'm gonna keep it at 15. Actually, let me make it a bit shorter at 10 seconds seconds so I can create um, something that I can actually post right now. So now I'm going to click on set timer over here. Okay, so if I'm going to be recording this, I just simply get into the camera and I press this big massive play button over here. Three, two, one. Okay, and it's done. So the next thing I might want to do is I might want to add other features to it. So it's it's over there, my video is right there. Now I'm going to, so there are a number of other fun things that you can do. You can add stickers as you could with your stories. So the only negative thing about stickers over here is that you won't be able to add any of the fun stickers such as polls or any of the engagement stickers, um, but you can certainly add lots of other stickers. So if I wanted a heart, for example, I could add one in the corner. Um, you can also draw um, as you could on other things. So if I wanted to draw a, a quick heart over there or delete it rather, undo. Okay, brilliant. So if I wanted to, to uh, go ahead and draw something, uh, perhaps I want to draw a heart over here right? And if I wanted to do um, any other things, I'm going to click on done. And um, you can also type here. So I could type and say, can you guess what new IG feature my video is about? And I can move that around to whatever, you know, wherever I want that to be. Now, when it comes to publishing your video, how do you publish? You simply click on this arrow over here to the right. So I click this, to the right and it's going to give you several different options now i like to have this on because it says also share to feed because then it goes to your reels feed and there you have it over here you can add your caption over here 
add your caption you can also then add your hashtags which i'm not going to do right now for the sake of time you can then also add your hashtags and then all you do to actually share it is to hit the share button so i'm just going to edit this because i do want to um, share this now just finished recording recording today today let's do a quick spell check there uh, can you guess what new ig feature my video is about so i might edit that later to add my hashtags but for now um in order to just publish this i just click on share and that's it it's being shared to my instagram account so can you see how easy it is to create your reels to start using this new instagram feature so thank you so much for sticking around to the end as promised take a look at my instagram reels that helped me to gain um so many views in just a short space of time to be exact 1974 people have viewed these two videos let's take a look hey guys so today i am smashing out all of my videos for the month of september that's right every single month i take out one day where i record all of my content for that month and today is the day